Welcome to State of Tech. Here's an iPhone 6 tip for you. I'm going to show you how to change your wallpaper. Tap on these settings and we're going to scroll down until we see the wallpaper. Tap there and I can now choose a new wallpaper or I can kind of edit the wallpapers I currently have. Down below the choose a new wallpaper you see I have my lock screen and home screen. If I tap on those what it lets me do is basically shut the perspective zoom off. So you see I can rotate my device and the wallpaper kind of moves around. If I turn that off, notice the wallpaper locks into place. And if I set it, my wallpaper will no longer move if I have my perspective parallaxing turned on. Now to choose a new wallpaper, we'll tap choose new wallpaper. Here I have my Apple wallpapers up at the top and I have photos down below. So if I choose dynamic, these are kind of moving wallpapers. So if I choose one of the colors, You'll see some of the little bubbles start floating around the screen and appearing. And if I move my device, they kind of rotate with me. If I tap set, we'll set to our home screen. And now I'm going to come back out to my home screen. And notice that I now have these little blue floating bubbles that are going around my home screen. It makes the app icons a little bit easier to see. But these dynamic wallpapers will run your battery down a little bit quicker than using a still wallpaper. Come back into the settings, we're brought back into the dynamic menu. We'll come back out to the stills. These are Apple's default wallpapers. I can go ahead and swipe through and see them all. If I find one that I like, just tap on it. We can choose to do perspective zoom. We'll tap set. We can set for both lock screen and home screen or set for both. I'll go ahead and set for my home screen. And now we'll come home and notice that the wallpaper has now changed to what I just selected. Coming back into the settings, and if we come back into the main wallpaper section, you'll notice that I have two different wallpapers, my lock screen and my home screen. Now let's say I wanted to add in my own photo. I'll tap choose wallpaper, and I can come into the photos section. I see all photos, favorites, and panoramas. I'm going to go ahead and tap into all photos, and this is going to allow me to choose a photo. So if I wanted to use this photo of a Taco Bell sauce packet, I can tap there. I can rearrange the photo, I can pinch the zoom in or zoom out. Notice if I zoom out too much, perspective zoom is going to turn off and it's going to snap the wallpaper right there to wherever I put it. But if I zoom in a little bit, maybe get a little bit closer, perspective zoom will turn back on and the wallpaper can kind of rotate with my device. So now if I tap set and I tap set to my home screen or lock screen, it's going to set that photo, setting wallpaper, we're done. Now if I come back out, notice I now have a Taco Bell sauce packet for my wallpaper. So that is how you change your wallpaper to either one of the default ones or one of your photos on your iPhone. And for more iPhone tips and tricks, be sure and visit stateoftech.net.